It's Wild here and today I'm going to be going over my updated top 10 budget AK crafts on CS2. Today's giveaway is an AK Redline. Remember, I do daily giveaways that you guys can vote on. And if you want a chance in winning, drop a like, comment, and make sure you're subbed with noties on. Winner will be picked tomorrow live on Discord. And the winner from my previous video will be in the pinned comment. Start off in the number 10 position with an AK-47 slate with four battle scarred hollows. And no, of course, guys, these stickers aren't necessarily budget. But I thought I'd include this slate as for a lot of people, it's a great price. The slate in field tested goes around $1.00. 90 so pretty much anyone can grab one and then pick up four budget stickers and create their own craft remember guys always look for pre-crafted slates because there are a lot of them of course be sure to check empire to get one below buff price or use the link in my channel bio to check any of my other affiliates but even if you got this on steam it's still a bargain i actually found this exact craft up on empire for 12 dollars, so make sure to always check before crafting one yourself next in the number nine spot i've gone with the ak-47 green laminate with four nuke beast papers on and yeah i've always really really liked this craft just because because as a green skin, and just green skins in general on CS2, just, I don't know, they look really, really nice. And yeah, this Nuke Beast sticker, don't really see it that much in-game. So, yeah. Overall, just a really underrated sticker and a really, really nice craft. Oh, in field tested, the green laminate goes for around about $11. But these stickers are like $0.09 cent each. So in total, you're looking at around about $11.36 for the craft. So yeah, overall, pretty budget for like a super nice green AK. It might fit your loadout. In the number eight spot, I've gone with the AK-47 Rat Rod in field tested, which you can get for around about $3.20, along with four Orc Wah stickers. I mean, it just reminds me of Mario. <laughs> But yeah, these stickers go for like 20 cent each. So in total, this is around a $4 craft. So yeah, considering how good the colors go and how well it kind of matches the rat rod theme, I think this is an absolute banger craft. Next in seventh place, we have the AK-47 Frontside Misty, infield tested, which you can get for around about 12 bucks, along with four RMR 2020 Team Spirit foils, which go for around about $1.20 each. So in total, you're looking at just over $16 for this craft. And honestly, you'll be able to find this pre-crafted. I just thought I'd include it. Like I don't really like to use team stickers, but I just think this one goes so perfectly together that, especially considering how cheap it is, it's, uh, yeah, definitely worth the pickup. Next in the number six spot, we have the AK-47 Redline in field tested. Now, this is a low float field tested, but you can get one for around about $13.50. Now, the Battle Squad papers are kind of expensive at around $2.20 each, but you really can't go wrong with this craft, guys. Like, you could do this on a slate as well, but obviously... The red line, like it just matches the red Battle Scarred stickers. And yeah, overall, I love this craft. Yeah, it will cost you around about 22 bucks to craft though. So yeah, again, always make sure to check third party marketplaces for pre-crafts because I'm sure you'll find one for cheaper than that. Next in the fifth spot, I have the AK-47 Orbit Mark 1 in field tested, which you can get for around about $9, along with four Blood Moon Tenter Skulls, which go for around 55 cent each. And I mean, yeah, guys, just look at this. Like the colors match perfectly. I actually included this AK in my previous video for the best budget red loadout. So yeah, if you're looking for a sticker craft for that budget red loadout, then yeah, I would definitely recommend this craft. I also like it because even though there's like white outlines, there's kind of white bits on the top of the skin. It kind of matches in that way. So yeah, overall W craft, which will cost you around about $11.20. Next up in the fourth spot, we have the AK-47 Neon Revolution in field tested, which goes for around about 12 bucks with another set of tenter skulls being the watermelon tenter skulls, which go for around about 85 cent each. So in total, this craft is like $15.40, but yeah, it just looks absolutely insane, guys. Like I really like the Neon Revolution on CS2. I think the colors absolutely pop. And then these stickers just match perfectly with it. So yeah, absolutely W craft in my opinion. Now for the top three, we start with the AK-47 Legion of Anubis in field tested, which goes around about seven bucks. And then if you pair that up with four Sphinx papers, which go for around about 20 cent each, you're looking at around about a $7.80 craft, which is just absolutely insane. And yeah, it just matches the theme of the Legion of Anubis. And yeah, overall, just honestly, one of my favorite crafts in the entire game. I think it it also helps that the Legion of Anubis just looks so much better now on CS2. So yeah, W craft. Now in second place, we have a craft that I've used before, but it is the AK-47 Wasteland Rebel in field tested, which you can get for just over 20 bucks with four Rage Papers on. Now again, the Rage Papers are like $2.40 each. So in total, you're looking at around about a $30 craft. But remember guys, you can find some of these pre-crafted, but yeah, overall, this just goes perfectly, guys. Like it almost looks like it's part of the skin. And I really, really like crafts like that because it just, you know, adds a bit to the sticker design makes the skin stand out a bit more compared to a regular default one and yeah overall this is just an absolute juice of craft but guys it is time now for the number one position and for that i've gone with the ak-47 nightwish infield tested which goes for around about 12 bucks with four dead eye hollows on now the dead eye hollows are a bit more expensive around about three dollars and fifty cents so in total you're looking at spending around about 25 bucks for this craft but again 
probably find this pre-crafted or at least partly pre-crafted. And I mean, just look at this, guys. Like, not only is the Nightwish one of my favorite AKs on CS2, but yeah, these stickers just match it perfectly. You could even miss out some of these if you want, like, that main design in the middle in the second position. But yeah, I mean... Just color-wise, this just absolutely pops and just adds that little bit of extra flair to the Nightwish. But yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think of these crafts. What would you change? Can you think of any other insanely good budget crafts? If you can, leave them down below in the comments. And if you want to watch some more CS2 content, click the video on your screen right now.